from the trap your man Netho of Gullet had set. Write that down. I want to be sure the paperwork's in order now. Well, national interest calls on one to forge difficult alliances at times. Alliances with witches. Answer that question. Ah, so Letho's hiding from you. Must have a good reason. Was there a shift in national interest that might have caused that? I don't know where he is. Wouldn't tell you if I did anyway. Blade or no blade to my throat. I believe that is all. Your signature, please, affirming you stated the whole truth and nothing but the truth on pain of imprisonment or death, etc. Et Here, um, here. With these formalities seem to. I would ask the general to leave the room. We shall be choosing the gentleman's attire. An important matter, but one that does not require the general's assistance. Shame. I might have given you some advice. So long, Count. Good luck with your audience. All right. Uh, I don't know how that's going to affect my gameplay. Hope it doesn't affect it too much. Feels more like I'm being ready for a wedding. Were that so, I would have prepared the gentleman a frock, a tail coat, or possibly a dinner jacket. In point of fact, the gentleman will choose from these garments. Black, black. Black. We do not like garish colors in Nilfgaard. The gentleman will tell me once he has chosen an outfit. Alright, um... Definitely not that one. So I'm gonna go with this one. This might come as news to the gentleman, but the towel wrapped around one's waist is not fitting attire for an audience. The gentleman will kindly dress. Hey, hold on. God damn. say clothes do not make the man does the outfit satisfy the gentleman yeah fuck it. it doublet and a sword on my back that's what would satisfy me but tough when in Nilfgaard yes it's a saying so what now powder my nose no need the gentleman's complexion is light enough. The gentleman is to stand before the ruler of the north and south. I must confirm that he knows how to bow. I'm not some boar. I know how to bow. Please, demonstrate. That, sir, is how you might bow to a whore on a street corner. <laughs> the Emperor of Nilfgaard. <laughs> Please watch. Leg extended, hand flat, head down, chin to chest. The gentleman will rehearse. Wrong, wrong, wrong. Once more. Leg extended, hand flat, head down, chin to chest. The gentleman will rehearse. Oh, so it's left leg. Okay. Hmm. Lacking fluidity and grace. But we've learned to expect less of Nordlings. Come with me. 
Asshole. I should punch you right in the face. The gentleman will address the Emperor only when asked to, and using the appropriate title. Your arch magnificency. I see the gentleman is in the mood for jests. I fear the Emperor might not share his disposition. Your Majesty will suffice. Spoken loudly, clearly, and with respect. Right, once I'm done talking with the Emperor, I'll end the episode there, and I will... I guess see you guys in the next episode. I thought you bowed before no man. Didn't want to disappoint the Chamberlain. We're friends. Taken here didn't summon me to reminisce about the good old days, so. Silence. My daughter Cyrilla, she's returned. And she's in danger. The wild hunt pursues her. You will find her and bring her to me. How many men in your army? 20,000? 30? So why me? You know why. Because she trusts you. She trusts me, yes. So tell me why you are looking for her. Doubt it's about making up for all those lost years. For reasons of state, as always. Enough of this banter. You will agree regardless. If for no other reason than because I shall pay you. More than you customarily receive for a contract. Considerably more. I need information, not motivation. Siri leaves few tracks. She'll be hard to find. My core of spies will help you. Count on them and my army, should the need arise. Yennefer will tell you the rest. This audience is finished. Meredith! Take him to the sorceress. Alright, so we found out Siri is this guy's daughter. <clears throat> Follow me if the gentleman pleases. Please keep close. There are many honorable guests in the palace whom the gentleman disgusts. Need not bother. He's slow as hell, come on. Can't you walk a little faster than that? Once the gentleman is done, he should need to retrieve his possessions. Guessing through here? Yes, then that's right. The true authority in Novigrad is not the city council or the merchant's guild. It's the church of the eternal fire. There's Yennefer. Smashing. Ugh, dying to take it off. I'd consider that a proposition under different circumstances. One I might even take you up on. But we've matters to attend to. <laughs> now do you understand why I'm at Amir's court? Mm -hmm. And seems we're in the same boat now. Siri, 
she's really back. No chance he's mistaken. Look, that's more or less what she looks like now. Or so our agents claim. Our little witch has grown into a young lady. Hmm. Huh. So they're our agents now? My, my. You've clearly settled in quick. Geralt, don't twist my words. I know who Emir is. He started this war and its bloodshed. He had my friends killed. But I haven't any other choice. So please, let's not belabor the pros and cons and instead focus on finding Siri. All right? Right. Emir said the wild hunts after her. I'd find that hard to believe before what happened yesterday. How did they track us down? Because of me. You see, I've spent months searching for Siri, using locating spells, haruspicy, geomancy, anything, really. I knew the Wild Hunt might sense it, perhaps even find me, but I thought I'd trick them. Well, guess you were wrong. Hmm. I've sensed them on my trail, hunting me for some time. If not for you and Amir's soldiers, they'd have gotten what they were after. I can't risk another encounter like that. It's time to put away the magic, turn to more traditional methods. To the best tracker I know. You must find her, Geralt. Before the Wild Hunt does. So where's Ciri been seen, exactly? In two places. Velen and Novigrad. The trail in Velen is most promising. You should make that your first stop. Ask for a merchant named Hendrik at the inn at the crossroads. One of the Emperor's agents. He should get in touch with you. That's it? No passwords? Secret handshakes? None. Sorry to spoil your fun. Your boyhood fantasies about the crafts of the trade. All we have in Novigrad are unconformed reports, rumors. But there you will have the help of our mutual acquaintance. Triss Merigold. Apparently she's got a cozy flat on the main square. I'm sure she'll be delighted to see me. What about you? What will you do? I shall sail for Skellige. There was a magic explosion there recently, blew half a forest down. I believe this had something to do with Siri. I'll be in care trolled. Join me there once you've learned something. Okay. Guess this means we need to split up again. Not my preference, but I understand. Clock's ticking. It is indeed. So why don't I teleport you to Vel and get you there at once? Not gonna happen. I'll go on horseback as soon as I can get changed. Have it your way? Oh, and you really look quite dashing in black velvet. Think so? Maybe I can have some of my armor lined with it. <laughs> Good luck, Yen. Same to you. And if you wish to learn what's happened in the world while you and Vesemir roam the wilderness, talk to Ambassador Vartra. That's him over there. And Geralt, I know it's wartime, but try not to be a hero, all right? Just check those leads and come back to me in one piece. I shall be waiting. All right. Um, before I do that, before I'm going to end the episode, let me level up real quick. Done. Get my equipment back. By returning my things. Citrus and cloves. The fragrance will keep the gentleman's robes fresh somewhat longer. Thanks, bunches. The Emperor is not known for his patience. He wants his daughter back safe and sound, as soon as possible. Yeah, mention something of a sort. So long. 
Alright, so trap little villain. Let me get put my stuff back on. Silver sword. Nope. All right. So, guys, um, I'm going to end the episode here. Um, so, thanks for watching. Hit that subscribe button, um, like my videos, comment if you have any questions, concerns, whatever. I'll answer you as soon as possible, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Thanks for watching again. Peace out.